What is going on YouTube? Welcome to another NBA 2K21 video. Um, in today's video, we're going to be discussing whether or not uh, these new cards that 2K just dropped, this new promo that they just dropped, whether it's worth it, whether you should be going out and getting these cards. Um, now, in case you guys don't know, uh, today is the 18th, September 18th, and 2K just dropped these uh, new idol cards including this Manu Ginobili who right now is going for earlier he was going for 198 um, he's dropped down a little bit to like 148 uh, one you know even 130 man uh, listen I'm a Spurs fan uh, this guy right here he technically he like he embodies the word idol like no other player for basketball could you know could ever have the same impact that Manu Ginobili had for me. I'm an Argentinian American, um, and as you guys know, Manu Ginobili is from Argentina. He is a hero. Okay, he's an absolute like an absolute hero. Um, in Argentina, people like you know what I'm saying think he's you know he's an ambassador for the game. Um, it is because of him that it's actually like cool as you guys in case you guys don't know like in South America and especially in Argentina um, uh, American or not American. I'm sorry European football. So soccer is very important down there um, And nobody really plays basketball man. And ever since he came he rose to like like stardom um, I'm not gonna talk too much about it. I'm sorry if I'm making this about him, but whatever uh, He like it's he made it like cool for players to want to play basketball You know what I'm saying? Like there's not more basketball courts the last time I went to Argentina was a uh, 2019 I believe 2018 and there was there, I've never seen so many basketball courts like there is now like he's an absolute absolute like Legend in Argentina. Okay. I it's the, he's the reason I started watching basketball He's the reason I'm a Spurs fan even to this day. I will always be a Spurs fan He's there. He's the reason so I love I love him more than anybody could ever like care for an NBA player obviously unless you know them unless they're your family member, but Yeah, he means a lot to me that being said I would not pay a hundred whatever even if he's a hundred K bro. I understand. He's a pink diamond I would not pay a hundred K for this card, bro. There are literally I'm gonna name you five cards. I'm gonna name you not name you and I'm gonna show you Okay, I'm gonna show you five cards that can do exactly what this card can do Okay, please do not go out and I mean unless unless you have unlimited amounts of, of money or even MT unless you you know what I'm saying? You absolutely need him because he's a crutch. Okay, people. I'm not, and I'm not. I'm not, I'm not trying. I'm not trying to put anybody down. Uh, by the way, I have a no money spend series, man. And um, in case you guys don't know, uh, make sure you guys go and check that out. We're gonna grind, and I'm gonna show you that you don't have to spend a single dime on this game in order to have a good team. All you have to do is grind, and it's not even that much of a grind. It's, you could do two, three hours a day, um, and you could like I do. I don't, I don't play the game all day. Okay, I, I do other stuff. But anyways, man. Um, I'm not, I'm just, you know, I'm just plugging up, you know, I'm just plugging my, you know what I'm saying, my, my little series or whatever. But anyways, man, a lot of people that I've played use him as a crutch, okay? Because obviously they want to have the best cards in the game. And I'm not trying to say like people that use him aren't good. I'm saying like they feel like they need to get uh, the best player possible in order to win. And trust me, guys, you do not you do not just follow my channel I will I will be coming out with tips and tricks this year on how to be a, a an above average top 80 80 percentile NBA player you don't even have to be good in a pro okay you just have to make smart plays all right that being said this card is not worth it bros let's take a look at his badges and again bro this is coming from a guy who absolutely idolizes this guy no pun intended because obviously he's part of the idol set but I, I love this guy man He's got an 88 three-pointer, 92 mid-range is pretty decent actually, 96 layup, he's got a 70 driving dunk, pretty decent ball handle, only a 70 steal, only an 80 perimeter defense, uh, decent rebounding, but even DeMar DeRozan has a 60 rebound, so I don't, I don't really think it means that much. Decent speed, speed with ball, okay, I'm, I'm, let's compare him to, see I don't even have that great of a team bro, uh, because again, I, I'm not trying to spend any money right now. But even comparing him to Deshaun Stevenson, bro. Like, okay, he's okay. Maybe, maybe I'm reaching. But still, bro. Like, he's not 85 lateral quickness. 
88 acceleration, 95 offensive consistency is pretty good. Let's take a look at his badge. He's only got 20, 20 Hall of Fame plus gold badges, bro. It's not that much. He's got Acrobat, which is, is a good badge. I'm not going to lie to you. He was kind of, he wasn't killing me, but like he was scoring on me. But to be honest, bro, in limited, you guys are going to see my team. And if you guys uh check out episode number five, I did play some limited games. I'm not going to spoil them for you, but I did play some limited games. Okay. And any, most players in this game can hit semi-contested layups okay contact layups most of the players in this game i have clay thompson on my team and he made contact layups okay so you you don't need this card dudes you don't need this card you don't need all these badges i'm telling you limited is not the most difficult game mode okay he might be good he might be good for triple third offline but even then or online i'm sorry but even then you have to use the stick bro he's got dimer which is pretty important space creator hot zone floor general pig dodger does he have clamp he has bronze clamps dude he's he's not worth it i'm telling you does he what's his quick first step he doesn't even have quick first step hold on let me just make sure he's got pickpocket dead eye clutch clutch shooter is kind of important this year i'm not gonna lie to you guys pig dodger flashy He's got no quick first step. You're paying 100k. 100 plus. Because some people... Like I said, just before... I was I just, I was just watching the Lakers game. That was like two hours ago. Two hours ago, he was going for 198, bro. 198. This card has no quick first step, dudes. Do not buy this card. Okay? Now, let... Uh, sorry. This Alonzo Morning is decent. But there's no collection reward. This card is absolutely not worth it, man. 60k for a guy who can't shoot threes okay he's got 19 badges post move lockdown rim protector but he's only he's six he was actually 611 in real life but he's only 610 in the game with short arms not worth 60k paul george um decent card i'm not gonna lie he's a decent card he's kind of like the meta i've played against the sapphire paul george the Sapphire, Sapphire Paul George is a uh, pretty decent. He's a pretty decent card, but there's no way in hell, bro. There is absolutely no way in hell that I'm paying 100k for this card. 83 three pointer. He has 12 gold badges, including catch and shoot. He has pogo, chase on artist. Like they're just useless badges. Ankle breaker. You're not gonna break anyone's ankles. Clamps is pretty decent. Interceptor's pretty decent. Off ball's pretty decent. Off ball pest. Dead eye. He's got. He's got no corner special. I mean, he's got no corner specialist. Or did I did I miss it? He's got bronze intimidator, which is not that good. He's got quick first step. That's pretty decent silver. He's got he's got he's got no corner specialist, bros. Again, this card is not worth it. 80k, 70k, he's not worth it. Rip Hamilton can do Rip Hamilton Ray Allen can do 80 to 95% of what that of what that Paul George is gonna do for you, bros. I'm telling you. This Luis Scola, uh, he's got putback boss, pretty decent. He's only got 12 badges in total, 79 three-pointer. That's that's all right. I, I think he has corner specialist. Yeah, bronze corner specialist. Um, this card has good value, 9K for for an amethyst, especially because uh, there a lot of amethysts, uh, even like including like the current players, are a lot of are a lot of coins. Um, I believe you can use him in uh, limited this week. Um, yeah, this this might be a decent card. He's only 6'9", though, which is kind of a problem. Uh, terrible perimeter defense. Decent rebounding. Speed with ball is bad. His, I mean, he's all right. For 9K, like I said, I think I would go with somebody like... It depends on your play style. If you do want to, like, you know, uh, go down into the paint, there, I'm pretty sure... Um, I, I don't know. I don't know how I would use this card. To be honest, I would bring him off the bench and like, uh, like, uh, like a as a specialist in case I needed some some quick buckets. But to be honest, I don't really think. I mean, this card is good. It has a good value. Okay, don't get me wrong. It's got good value. You could probably get him for like 8k. Probably you get get him on bid for I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know how much you can get him for. It's 8k is not the worst thing in the world. This card right here. Unless you're a stick shooter, man, and I'm telling you, unless you're 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 a, you're an absolute stick god, like DBG says, unless you're a stick god, I again, I if you're running a no money spend, again, if you have unlimited MT, 
obviously do, do not listen to what I'm saying. Uh, I mean, listen to what I'm saying, but... Because there's no better... If you have unlimited MT, there's no better cards. Obviously, you're going to go out and want to get this card. He's 7'3". Not the quickest card in the world. I've blown past him a couple times with uh, with Emerald Marc Gasol, with LaMarcus Aldridge. Just a very average card. He's got length on him, which is probably like the best thing about him. He's got drop stepper, catch and shoot. Only an 82 three-pointer, though. Um, he's got silver intimidator. He's got brick wall, bronze rim protector. Um, this is a decent card, man. If you can get him for about 40k... That would be pretty decent, but I I wouldn't spend this much money on a car. Like if you're on if you're on a limited budget, I would not spend this much money on a, on a center, because you can go out and you can get Ryan Hollins. I'm telling you, Ryan Hollins is an absolute monster, man. Go watch my my no money spend series. Ryan Hollins is an absolute monster. You can get Rudy Gobert, who can do 80% of what this card can do, especially on on defense. He can do 90% of what Porzingis can do on defense. I'm telling you, I'm telling you right now. Okay, he can do 90%. Go get you an Akeem. I don't know how much Akeem is worth. Actually, let me go look because I'm actually wondering how much he's worth. Uh, where's Akeem? He's playoff stopper, right? No. Akeem back to back? No, where's Akeem? Why is he in playoff east? The Rockets are not in the east. What? Hello? Oh, it's West. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Shh, shh, shh. Quiet, quiet, quiet. Everyone shut up. Everyone shut up. Yeah, see, this card's 100k. I'm not gonna lie. This card was clamping me up. This card absolutely... I played a game, and this card absolutely changed the game. He's a game changer, okay? Akeem Olajuwon is a game changer. If you have unlimited coins, go out and get you an Akeem Olajuwon, okay? If you don't, if you're on a budget, I would not start with a big man. I would start... I would get some shooters, definitely get some shooters, get Ray Allen, get, um, get you, maybe even Rip Hamilton, um, go out and get you Byron Maxwell, I feel is a very good card, Deshaun Stevenson as well, um, go out and get you a Ray Allen for sure, Ray Allen is an absolute sniper, Mitch Richmond also is a good card, and he's only worth, wow, he's worth 30k, Mitch Richmond is a definite, a definite W, but yeah, man, uh, Patty Mills, he's he's a very good budget card. Um, if you can get him for around 4K, is pretty decent. His only problem is he doesn't have... He has an 88 three-pointer, which is pretty good. Um, Kenny Smith is actually a good shot, too. Um, he doesn't have range extender, which is a problem. But if you're a point guard, man, and you, you, you know how to shoot with the stick... I don't think actually a lot of players have range. I don't know if I don't know if Kenny has it, but I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to look. But I'm, I'm definitely going to pick up this Patty Mills card. Actually, let's put a bid right here. Um, I'm actually going to try to pick up this Patty Mills card, obviously, because I'm a Spurs fan. I might put him in, into my lineup. Um, but right now, man, I'm just focused on doing XP challenges, so I'm not... All, the, all, my, all my MT, I'm using it to, like, buy cards so that I can complete, um, so I can complete challenges and stuff. But yeah, man, I, I don't... This was a good promo, I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, 2K is doing what they always do, they've done in the past two years, is they're putting out the players... They're putting out the players that they know um, come like January, February are not going to be sought after. They're going to start releasing the more popular players like, you know, uh, Paul Georges of the world, the obviously the Michael Jordans, uh, the, you know, high flyers like Vince Carter. Um, they're going to start releasing those cards like later on. Right now, they're 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 getting they're getting all the cards out that they know people would only use if the game had just come out. Um, but yeah, man, um, if you enjoyed this video, man, uh, we're coming out with a lot of these discussion based, uh, NBA 2K videos. Um, we're also, you know, we're doing constant content, man. Uh, so please, uh, if you're new to the channel, you would, you know, you want to stay up to date with all NBA 2K stuff, man. Uh, go ahead and like this video, subscribe if you would like. Um, but yeah, man, it, it's, it's a pretty decent, I'm not going to just to wrap everything up. It's a pretty decent promo. I'm not going to lie. But there's players that you can get, man, that can do 80% of what these cards can do and are 10% are of the price, okay? Um, so I would definitely look into that, man. I'm, I'm, I might be coming out with a, uh, like a 10K budget team builder, budget squad builder, the best budget cards in the game. R Richard Lewis definitely up there. Um, 
I kind of regret selling mine, but again, I'm, I can't be a, I can't have 10k tied up into a player right now Simply because I'm trying to do all these challenges and I'm, I'm working with a budget. You know what I'm saying? Um, but anyways, man, thank you guys so much for watching man. if you stuck around to the end of the video, man uh, I really do appreciate it um, Yeah, man, it's your boy Mokara, man, and I'm out. Peace up Why is he in playoff east? The Rockets are not in the east. What? Hello? Oh, it's west. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Shh, shh, shh. Quiet, quiet, quiet. Everyone shut up. Everyone shut up.